I've got up early to do my school project this morning, Mum. Wow, what's put that on? Well, I knew you were worried I wouldn't get it done in time. And I was hoping to go to a gig next week, if you're OK with that. Well, that depends on how late it finishes and who else is going. Well, Lachlan will be there and loads of other girls from school. What did your dad say? Oh, I didn't want to bother him about it. She means he said no. He's been really mean about it. Well, I'm sorry, Gabby, but I really can't go against him on this. Well, it seems a shame when all her friends are going there. Perhaps I can have a word with Ashley. Are you serious? You went round there? Are you all right? I got through it. Just wait till they put him inside. You're never going to have to see him again. I'm not sure that's how it's going to go now. That's why I called you. But why? What else has happened? Liv's got a recording of you admitting to bribing Ryan. What? We found out the Gordon's the one who sent around here. Has she given it to him? Not yet, no. We had a row and then she ran off. She'll have gone straight to him. No, she went back to her mum's. Well, it's only a matter of time. She came here to spy on you. She's got what she wanted now. Aaron, I'm so sorry. This is all down to me. I don't blame you. And she's still my sister. She heard what you put me through. If she believes me, then there's a chance that she might still do the right thing. Yeah, we've both seen what she's like. Yeah, a frightened kid who let Gordon sweet talk her. Don't forget, you've done some pretty bad stuff and all. But you've been there for me through all of this, and I don't want to see you get done for trying to help me. We've just got to hope that Liv comes through for us. Just gives me the opportunity. I'm sorry to interrupt. Uh, uh, could I have a word, Ashley? I better get going. Best of luck. What's in your mind? Gabby's really upset that you won't let her go to this gig. Oh, yes, but from what I've heard, the music isn't suitable for her age. Has Bernice asked you to speak to me about this? No, no, she wouldn't go against your decision. Well, then surely that's an end to it. There you are. Been trying to reach you all day. We had DSYs looking for you earlier. So Liv did go to police, then? No, it was Gordon that made the accusation about Ryan, but he had no evidence to back it up. Wise says that Liv and Sandra have disappeared now, too, so can't speak to them about it. Well, I've been trying to get hold of them, but they won't answer. No, if she stays away, they can't use the recording, so maybe it's best if no one speaks to her. Is it? I mean, don't forget me and Sandra can't give evidence either, so it'd be my word against his. And I've only just found my sister. I don't want to lose her again. Yeah, I know, love, but with everything that's going on at the moment... Not this again. Well, I think that young lady may be a bit more trouble than she's worth. Yeah, well, you always expect the worst of her. With what I've been through in my life, I think it's probably the safest way to be. Hiya. Uh, did you tell my dad he should let me go to the gig? Hmm? Oh, I tried, Gabby, but he wouldn't listen. I'm sorry. Guess you'll have to go without me. So it's me. But I don't know why you're giving up so quickly. There's nothing else I can do. Yeah, there is. It's easy. What do you mean? Well, your dad keeps forgetting things, doesn't he? So you tell him that he gave you permission. You know, he'll just think he forgot. I couldn't do that. But I could be your witness. I mean, for a price. You're wasting your time, Bernice. You obviously can't face me. 